Yeah, I forgot what I was going to say. So. Oh, welcome back to my channel. For those that are new here, my name is Danielle Williams. I am from the Bahamas, so I'm a Bahamian. Um, I'm 25 years old and I live in China. Everybody's going to be like, what are you doing in China? I'm studying medicine in China. I'm actually um, a scholarship student, so I study medicine, but I study medicine in Chinese. I study Western medicine in China in Chinese. That's crazy. That's crazy. It's pretty hard, but I would say for those who like a challenge and who kind of get bored somewhere along their journey, I think it's the best option for people like for people like us because I get bored really, really often. The next question that somebody once asked somebody like me is, how long have you been in China? I've honestly been in China for a very long time and it's it's scary because I feel like it's second home now. I never thought that China would feel like home to me, but I've been in China since 2015 and that's like almost five years. That's almost five years I've been in China. And honestly, I can say that I've gotten used to the idea of speaking Chinese as a second language because honestly, Chinese is my second language now because in the Bahamas, her mother tongue is English. Of course, we have French, Spanish, the dialect, then you have Creole, but for me, my mother tongue is um, English. I never thought Chinese would be my second language, but I'm used to the idea. And basically, my channel is kind of rebranding itself. I've been away from YouTube for a very long time. I haven't hidden my YouTube videos, but you're gonna see that I have been making YouTube content for a while. And I started from way back when, when I was in university, in the Bahamas actually. Um, so my channel has always been a mismatched bit of content, but right now I'm actually trying to rebrand and make it a little bit, it a little more direct in the career that I'm choosing. So I'm studying clinical medicine, I'm writing my exams to be a doctor, I'm studying my MBBS degree. So all the content that you're going to see here is kind of geared towards that. Also, I will, because I travel often, I'll be doing vlogs eating videos, taste testing videos, study with me, you name it. But if you have any comments, if you have suggestions, feel free to leave it in the comment section below. Tell me what you want to see from me because I'm just all over the place everywhere. I'm studying my internship and I know that's exciting for people who are studying medicine. They want to see somebody working in the hospital and they want to see how working in the hospital works in China. So if you want to see anything, travel vlogs, wear videos to eat food, just anything, I'm here. Leave a comment in the comment section below and I will try to get that for you. I will try to get that content out for you, baby. Also, also, I would like to start a mini series on teaching Chinese. I know that that's exciting for people. Chinese is like so hard for some people, but I'm here to break it down for you guys. This Chinese isn't that hard to learn. I'm gonna tell Shui Han Yu. Okay, so Chinese isn't so hard to learn, and I wanna I wanna break that down for you guys. So if you guys like the idea of learning Chinese, leave a big thumbs up. Leave a comment section. Leave a comment in the comment section. Leave a thumbs up. Let me know what's good. Let me know if I should start this series. Let me know if you guys want to be on the wave to learn Chinese because I, I want to teach you guys. How many times a week are you going to be releasing videos? Well, let me answer your question. <laughs> I'm so glad you asked. I'm going to try to release videos, releasing videos at least two times a week. It'll be a vlog. It can be some language content, but it just depends on what you guys want to see that week. Right now, my schedule isn't so fixed and I am open to suggestions, so I'm pretty fluid on that. But when my schedule gets a bit hectic, I'm going to have to organize myself and I'm going to have to like, you know, this day, this day, this day. But for right now, since I'm on vacation, schedule is fluid two times a week. So for people who know me, they know that this is not my usual background. My background is the world, but <laughs> that sounds so corny. 
But right now, actually, I'm in South Korea. My sister was in South Korea. So I'm about to be here for about five weeks. I'm on vacation. Now we're gonna be vlogging, we're gonna be doing hauls, we're gonna be doing get ready with me, with in my bag, nice food. And we also have a special vlog for you guys coming up because actually this is my last time coming to South Korea on vacation because I don't have a vacation in my internship year, which is quite sad, I know, but I'm making the most of this moment. I want to dish out content, I want to try new things, have new experiences, I want to experience everything. Everything. Not for a long time, but for the last time on a solo vacation. Basically, that's about it I want to talk to you guys about. This is just me. Like, reintroducing myself to you guys for the new people who want to know me, who want to know what I'm all about. So, yeah. Um, oh, I, um, I told you I'm in medical school, but I forgot to tell you what school I go to. <laughs> I attend China Medical University. China Medical University, or Zhongguo Yikadashue, is one of the best universities in China. I was very blessed and very privileged to be amongst the people who were chosen to go to this school. Not saying that other medical universities in China aren't good, because they are, but my school is just is really great. My teachers are really great. Um, they're accommodating. They want to teach you, especially when you find a nice teacher that wants to teach you. Like, they go all out. But yeah, that's my school. I live in the northeast of China. Right now, it's the dead of winter. And it's so cold. It's so cold. It gets to negative 30 degrees. Let that sink into your soul. Okay, let's not complain, it's a blessing, and I thank God each and every day that I get the opportunity to study medicine, which is my passion, in a country that is not my own, but it's a nice privilege, it's a nice culture change, it's a nice change. If you guys see me sniffling, I'm actually trying to survive the cold. I just came to Korea like two days ago. When you see this, it might be like a week ago that I came to Korea by then, and Every time I travel, I get sick. So if you see me sizzling, I'm trying to find it. I don't want you guys to see what's going on. Yeah, I just want to say, welcome to my channel for the new people. Welcome back to my channel for my longtime viewers. And give me a like if you want to see content from me like this in the future or content from me in general. Leave a comment in the comment section. Leave a suggestion in the comment section Ooh, of what you want. And I will try my best to the best of my ability to get that content out for you guys. Whether it be teaching videos, whether it be vlogs, whether it be weird food, whether it be a study with me. Just let me know and I'm going to work on getting it out for you guys. I really appreciate you clicking and watching the video. This is a very short video, but I appreciate it. Remember to share this video with your family, your friends, your brother, your sister, everybody. Share it with them. Remember to like, comment, and subscribe. Share it on your social media. All of my links to my everything are in the down bar. If you want to follow me on Snapchat, Twitter, not really Twitter, I don't really, I'm not a Twitter fan. Snapchat, Instagram, uh, all of the things. Follow me there. And anyway, bye guys.